A muted check. Hello everyone. Nuclear venture on the bomb today. It's almost Christmas. Well picked up a new game. It's well it's not really new, it's been out for some time. <clears throat> but I've played it before and it was quite good. But that was on 360. Now we're going next gen. So Black Flag, if you haven't played the Assassin's Creed series, it's the... I want to say it's the fourth. Here we go. Oh, it's the wheel. Oh. Okay, this controller is kind of screwy. Hang on. <clears throat> Sorry, Cap, but you gotta move. Switch remote. Come on, Frisk. Much better. Use his dead ten way. You'll have to steer this. Oh, there they go. Ready to fire! Enemy reinforcements come That's another one. No, we cannot. Not in this store. We have been touched. And I don't like being touched. Goodbye. It's raining. Is it dangerous? Edward? Hmm? Privateering? Is it dangerous? Wouldn't pay so nice if it weren't. Why not sail with the King's Navy? Earn a proper wage? Sail under gentlemen? Sod the Navy's gentlemen. For every shilling I'd earn, the captain gets 600. That's no way to earn a fortune. We don't need a fortune. Uh... It's not about need, Caroline. 
I want food that don't make me sick. I want walls that hold back the wind. I want a decent life. Well, we got that, How but we need a fortune to get these it. Privateers. A year, I reckon. Two at the most. All right. No more than two. Promise me. I cannot promise that. Without a calendar, you can lose track of time really easily. I don't even know what day it is, but I know it's the 22nd. Saturday. In case y'all don't know, I really like the Assassin's Creed series. Before um, this one, my favorite would have to be the second. you was it good for you as well Havana I must get to Havana well I'll just build us another ship will I I can pay you isn't that the sound you pirates like best 100 Eskimos it's quite for some money keep talking Will you, or won't you? You don't have that gold on you now, do you? <laughs> Bloody fucking pirates! Ah, <laughs> and you're out of ammo. <laughs> I'm on to you, Sneaksby! Let's go. Come on, mate. We're off to a bad start. And I see the camera has still got a bug in it. <laughs> Needs or more to Havana. Will you walk that distance? <laughs> You'd have to be insane to walk that distance. But insanity is kind of a thing I do. This is new. I've never actually gone up that way. And there's bird poop on my shoe. work together on this I'm gonna synchronize first I don't feel like coming back 
Come on, let's go. Oh, <laughs> uh, that was easy. Too easy. Senor Duncan Walpole, I accept your most generous offer and await your arrival with eagerness. If you truly possess the information we desire, we have the means to reward you handsomely. Though so I will not know your face by sight, I believe I can recognize the costume made infamous by your secret order. Therefore, come to Havana in haste. Hmm. And trust that you shall be welcomed as a brother. Su más humilde servidor, el gobernador Laureano Torres y Ayala. A bent blade? That could be fixed easily. Mr. Walpole, let's collect your reward. And away to Havana. Well, certainly not that way. do me just fine. <laughs> oh, pardon me. Just finished up with breakfast. <clears throat> Zones. No, no, our destination is Havana. I'm just a merchant. Quiet, you bleeding pirate! You'll hang for the mess you made out there! Sir, I had nothing to do with this attack. My crew and I have merely anchored to water and resupply. <laughs> Hold it! Stop them! Then I shouldn't vent your skull. Take my sugar. Take anything you like. Weak. I'll pay you. Anything you like. Oh, God. Oh, God. Take my sugar! Take anything you like! Darn. Oh, I'll pay you! Anything you like! That's gonna get annoying real fast. Oh, God. I see oh, a body. God. I'm gonna loot it. What? No. He's not on. Take my sugar! Take anything you like! Da, 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 da. 
Come on. By God's grace, sir, you saved me. Again. Fusion of thanks. Is that yours? It is my vessel, yes. But uh, here lies its poor captain, and I have no art for sailing. I can pilot her myself, no mind. You don't mean to abscond with my ship, do you? I'm Duncan. What's your name, friend? Steed, Steed Bonnet. Well, Mr. Bonnet, let this stay twixt us. But I'm on a secret errand for His Majesty the King, God save Let's and see, I must the get stream, stream is about five seconds oh, behind. That is a relief, sir. Havana is also my destination. Our ways lie together. Natural allies, then. Ah, you put me at ease, sir. To think I took you for a pirate when you first appeared. Did you? Yes. You have an uh, uncommon way of handling yourself. Quick and easy, if I may say. Gave me quite a fright. Let's see. Box check and one, considered. two, I think it's turned out to be three, a rather fortuitous day, four, hasn't it? Five. Yep, five seconds behind. Lacking a rowboat, I'm afraid we'll have to swim to my ship. Treasure maps. I already know where the worst one thing. Is. And crack it open. Huh, fifteen hundred, not bad. They could have done a little more with the um, the ocean, but I ain't gonna. I'm a gamer, not a critique. Welcome aboard, Duncan. She's a modest schooner, but well suited to my purpose, trafficking cargo from my plantation and such. She'll do fine. There's a strong wind now. Let's strike to fall, shall we? Ah, there's a tug of the wind at my hair. Ah, I find a bracing comfort in the feel and smell of the ocean. The raw stink of... of possibility. That's one way to look at it. That's a top way of seeing it, mate. by the idea of pirates roaming these waters. Is it a real danger, do you suppose? A possibility. But most pirates stalk the windward passage between Cuba and Hispaniola. Oh, I see. Yes. That is a bustling strait. 
But I shouldn't worry about being waylaid by pirates, truth be told. My ship is small, and I have nothing of immense value. Sugarcane and its yields, molasses, rum, that sort of thing. <laughs> There's not a pirate living who'd turn his back on a keg of rum. Well, yes. That is true. Yes, I suppose that's true. Don't all but me! Loose main sails! There we are. Astounding. <laughs> You're a natural sailor, Duncan. I did a decent trick at the helm some time ago. Two years before the mast as a privateer. Dash my buttons. Your life seems a grand one, if I may say. So full of adventure. How marvelous. I've seen my share of strangeness, I. Everyone has had strange events in their lives. But this isn't a life of strangeness. This is a life of assassins. Fantastic work. Very promising. Welcome back. What? Well, your numbers look good. Now let's make sure we can break your brain, all right? I need you to move your head okay. and look at these lights just here. Look up. That's it. Down. Down. So far, so good. Let's get you up. So, welcome to the Sample 17 project. Before you get started, you're gonna need this. There you go. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Hello, bonjour. C'est bon? It works? Huh. All right, let's take a walk. Your file says you've done some memory research before, but not to this extent, which is surprising. You're very good. The data streams are very stable. You know, for a place with this Impressive, many... Impressive, okay. right? This building is barely six months old, but Abstergo Entertainment has been a studio for a few years, since 2010. His maternal grandmother's mother was Asian. Sounds confusing. Maybe you saw Liberation? That was nope. our first title powered by Animus Tech. That was just the tip of the iceberg. Soon, we'll be unveiling commercial Animus servers for the whole world to enjoy. They'll offer passive experiences, of course. Edited versions of real history. But only the exciting parts. And we think we found the perfect subject for our first full-length virtual feature. Caribbean Pirates. So that's your gig. It'll just take a minute, okay? Well, thank you, Nancy. Bon journée. I don't remember her from. Merci. This is for you. The primary tool of our trade. Your communicator. Power it up and give it a look. It's pretty slick. It's like an iPad, but better. You might have noticed that security seems a little light around here. That's because your communicator is your key to getting around. I remember him. He's from the other Assassin's Creed, but I can't remember his name. <clears throat> the audio can use a little work, too. Oh, that's See that flashing pointer. wireless signal? It means you're hooked up to the elevator. I'll let you do the honors. 
We're headed up to the Sample 17 studio, second floor. I like this. You ready? Let's go. Ah, there's the boss, Olivier Garneau, our CCO. I'll introduce you. Bonjour. Salut, Mélanie. Ça va bien? Well, thanks. Looks like a tech savvy boss. Have you met boss. our new hire? Just started today. I haven't. Bonjour. What project? Sample 17, the Kenway line. Hey, them. Connor. Edward, the pirate. Ah, ar, yar, maybe. <laughs> Very exciting. Welcome aboard. I have sadly have lost all means of respect for, for him. Just let me get this one settled and I'll see you in five minutes. C'est bon. Nice to meet you. I have lost all respect for you. So, this is the sample set. Sticky note that apparently is well printed with a QR code. Floor. We're diving into the memories of one very generous donor, Desmond Miles. We're pulling all the best stuff from his DNA. Didn't and hopefully he die? one day we can forge some fantastic experiences from what we find in there. This pair of legs is John, one of the wizards in IT. <laughs> He's just fixing something for you. Not fixing, calibrating. Calibrating, right. So here we are, your very own Animus workstation. Nice. This is all yours, so sit back, relax, and find us some good footage. If you need any hints or oh tips, the Animus my. is loaded with tutorial programs, so you'll have no problems. And I'll check in on you later. Happy pirating. This is a setup. Holy. One thing that bothers me, where's the mouse? I suppose that this is a heater? A halo ring light? Huh. High definition speakers with built in bases. Stargo Entertainment. What is this? A touch keyboard? One of those glass keyboards? Oh well, I'll geek out about it later. Welcome <sighs> to Animus Omega, Abstergo Entertainment's proprietary ancestral memory research tool. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about how to operate your Animus console, please contact your project supervisor, Melanie LeMay. You have been registered as part of the Sample 17 project. Your primary research target is Edward James Kenway, born March 10, 1693, Swansea, Wales. Calibrations complete. All signs normal. All systems optimal. Extra neurotransmitters activated. Hmm. Nice. This dives down to a neurological level. Is this Havana? Oh, there we are. Welcome to Assassin's Creed 4, Black Flag. Ah, uh, <laughs> lively Havana. I've been here once before. It was a truly awful pleasure. See someone you know? No, 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 just putting on a friendly face. I shouldn't want to be mistaken for a pirate again. Right. Again? Flash rogue like yourself must be cautious. Yeah. Again, the ambience is a lot more quiet than what it should be. Mad to think Spain and England were at war two years ago, isn't it? Here I am, bartering with Spaniards like they were my cousins. Nothing wrong, Duncan. No, it's nothing. Sand in my hampers. So where's the best squad in town? I'm dying for a quick kip. Or a siesta, should I say. Uh. Um, I'm just headed to uh, 
A public house now to meet some merchants. I could I could show you the way. Well, lead on. I hope you'll tarry a bit while I conduct my meeting. It'd be a great relief to have a man of your stature nearby. In case of a misunderstanding. I can hang about. I might have a drink. Spend it. A drink. <laughs> I'm quite positive that pirates to pirates here, do they? This spelt with an I, not a Y. Wonder how many stolen reals bought these men this perch. This is way too quiet. Hang on. I'm going to turn that off to um, not get entangled with copyright issues. Oh, a companion app. May as well go ahead and install that. Huh. It would have appeared to have been taken down. Unless it's just not for Android. Which that would suck. Hola, ladies. You don't know these women, do you? No. They charge money for that kind of privilege. A few dozen reals for every hour of knowing. Keen to meet them. No, goodness no, I'm a, I'm a married man. Married man of their forte, mate. Aha! Here's a purveyor of personal defenses. I should acquire a blade for myself, Duncan, just as you have. This rusty razor's nothing to admire. Even so, I appear a mere kitten walking so close upon you. Perhaps a small dagger would suit me. Let's see what he's selling. Maybe I'll buy a sword, too, and we'll both jump rank. Oh, we'll be quite the pair, you and I. Twin devils! <laughs> well, Lend I'm us a few more reals, the devil then. here. I did save your skin. Ah, uh, of course. Cheers. That's a better fit for me. How do you fare? I had only enough for a small knife, sadly. Still, it'll do in a pinch. Oh, puff a duff. I have led us astray, Duncan. Oh, no matter. I'll get us a better view. What are we looking for? Uh, a tavern. A sort of courtyard interior. My goodness, you're an agile chap. Every finger's a fish hook. That's how you tell a true sailor. <laughs> You are quite loud. a big place. I think I see the place. Ah. We're not no. far. Hang tight. I can't breathe. Stop or I'll break your knees when I catch you. I'm close at heel, shitbird! 
Whew. This dude's got a book. Here I come! Uh. Don't make me chase you into the harbor! Oh, I could have went up there. <laughs> the wrong man. A of oh dangerous man! <laughs> Straight off the roof. Oh, that's nasty. Oh my God. Get this look at the fuma. Get this look at the fuma. Get Come on, where's all this? Where's all the music? I am. That filch was no fuss. Oh, yes. <laughs> ah! We've arrived. Hmm. Take your time. I'll be just here. Why is it so dull? Hang on. Again. Vats meet no Welshman, deep in Dago country. I'm English myself. Biding my time till the next war calls me to service. Lucky King George, having a piss pot like you flying his flag. Oi! Skulk! I've seen your face before. You mates with them pirates down in Nassau. Shut your fucking gob or I'll fill it with shot, you hear me? <laughs> Edward, is it? Ooh. Uh, ooh. That's... You yeah, bastard! Hey, I warned him. Uh. 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 Oh, it's so dull. You want to dust up? I'll give you one. Come on, lads. I've seen bigger arms on a bird. Eliminalo! <laughs> I'm Audi. Un 
Nah. Oh, I got an A on this memory. That's mine. Well, at least now we're getting some sound in this. Sorry about the swift exit. Bit of a misunderstanding. One heap to put another. Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry, mate. This is my doing. I'm only trying to keep these Spanish eyes off me. Oh, it's no bother. Regrettably, the soldiers confiscated my sugar when your dispatches. Damn! And where have they gone? Haven't the foggiest idea, I'm afraid. I suspect those chaps might, but my Spanish is wee mal dad, so I'd, I'd rather not ask. Shit! All right, come on, let's follow them and recover my maps. And my sugar? What, in my drawers? We'll see what happens. <sighs> Before I do that, Okay. Hopefully the cutscenes will be able to... You don't mind me tagging along, do you? Not if you keep quiet and stay out of sight. Really? I believe I'm getting the hang of this. Quiet. I fear they're onto us. Hang back. Ooh, perhaps we should split up to confuse them. The best idea you had today. <laughs> Buenos dias, senores. You're late. Yes, sir. See, si, uh, we are very sorry. Our captain delayed us. This would be Captain Mendoza. Yes, sir. You must be present for a, a, a hanging. Hanging. 
Ah, I love a good hanging. Yes, sir. Very nice. If we hear the bells, we may go. If you like. I'd love to. Especially if Captain Mendoza's pulling the trap. The man owes me money for the slaves I sold him. Of course, sir. Captain Mendoza is happy to pay you. We have goods to sell, sugars and such. Excellent. The ambience is still off. Soon. Let's not silly dally. Yes, sir. We go. Good Lord. Will this hanging take, man? I don't mean to hang about all day for the captain. Wow. We cast anything, sir. Captain Mendoza needs only to hang the man, then he will deliver your payment. I don't want the alleys, mind. I want goods, things I can sell, tobacco, rum, sugar. See, si, see, si. we have much fine sugar. Rich, we took off a fat Englishman last night. How quickly does Englishman. time pass? See, <laughs> sugar from Barbados. Very fine. We hold it in the Castillo after the man started the fight last night. He ran, left his sugar behind. Very fine. Well, that's a start. Shall I accompany him to the Castillo? No, sir. Captain Mendoza will have it sent to you, I believe. You will see. Good lord. Is that big brute your Captain Mendoza? No, sir. He is El Tiburón. El Tiburón, Governor Torres's man. Wow. <clears throat> there you are.
Okay, let's fight. There. Now that, that, that whole charade's over with. Get the rest of this. Stay out of combat, huh? I can do that. Sharpshooter up top. Goodbye. Turn around. Escape.
Sorry about the sugar. I've only one pair of hands. Oh, it's no great loss. Uh, I've got uh, plenty of cargo here to make a profit on my trip. Will you stay here long? For a few weeks, yes. Then back to Barbados, to the tedium of domesticity. Don't settle for tedium. Sail for Nassau. Live life as you see fit. <laughs> Haven't I heard that Nassau is crawling with pirates? Seems a very tawdry place. Not tawdry, liberated. Oh, God. That would be an adventure. But no. No, I'm a husband and a father. I have responsibilities. Life can't be all pleasure and distraction, Duncan. Hey, our bonnet. The name's Edward, in truth. Duncan's only a handle. Ah. Secret name for your secret meeting with the governor. The governor, right. I think I've kept him waiting long enough. Are you serious? There we go. Pistols. <laughs> that is funny. I'm sorry, I'm looking at stuff Que tengan like buen phone. día y mucha suerte. Ego simple tutor picturus illustratus. Oh, sword. Oh. Two, three, one. Two, three, two. Oh, they're both two, three, twos. Wait, what? Okay, those are equipped. En otro momento, no hay prisa. No puede ser. Este pertiginem cadit fil capatres. Similiter de ie arisus. Belom ne vivimus. divimus. Puela era tonima calidad.
¿Verdad es necesario? Here we are. Buenos dias. Mr. Duncan Walpole of England to see the governor. I believe he is expecting me. Sí, señor Walpole. Entre, por favor. ¿Ese es el hombre? El... ¿Cómo lo llamabas? ¿Asesino? Sí, Duncan Walpole. Debería haber llegado hace muchos días. No me gusta que los extranjeros se paseen por nuestra ciudad. No me fío de ellos. Cállate. El gobernador tiene invitados. Todos franceses e ingleses. Parece un hombre rudo. Le suponía un aspecto más... respetable. Lleva meses en alta mar. Sé indulgente con él. Good morning, sir. Would I be correct in thinking you are done? I am indeed. I thought as much. Woods Rogers. <clears throat> the same. I must say, my wife has a terrible eye for description. I'm sorry? My wife. You met her some years ago at the Percy's Masquerade Balls. Ah. Quite. She called you devilishly handsome. Obviously, a lie to stoke my jealousy. <laughs> Julian, our guest of honor has arrived, Mr. Duncan Walpole. <sighs> Julian Ducas. <laughs> I hope your conversion to our order is an honest one. I have no love for assassins, but even less for liars. I have not come to disappoint. <laughs> Up for a bit of sport, Duncan? The old man isn't ready just yet. Very well. You've got my two best pairs of matched pistols, Duncan. So handle them with care. If I had eight, I'd treat each as my own son. Pull off a few shots if you like. Get a feel for it. <laughs> I once fought beside a man who carried nine on his person. He were a boom in battle, but hinder the ability to swim. Sadly. <laughs> White. A little kick, yes. No, the day one firearm carries four bullets and not the opposite. He. I see the game's got a bit of a, bit of a bug in it, because I know for a fact. That I do not friend in England, have. you may like to meet Julian. Pissed. Magnifique. All right. Here's a simple challenge. Try to strike every target before this hourglass empties. Remember, hit every target within the allotted time. Rotten luck, eh? Darn. Quite rotten luck. All right. Here's a simple challenge. Try to strike every target Once. before this hourglass empties. Remember, hit every target within the allotted time. There we go. <clears throat> Duncan, where are your wrist blades? 
I've never seen an assassin so ill-equipped. Ah, damaged sadly beyond all repair. Uh -huh. Have your choice. Where did you find all these? <laughs> I did not find them. I took them. These are souvenirs. <laughs> Two blades, as is the custom, eh? Custom, aye. Duncan, will you indulge us with a demonstration of your techniques? Well, uh... We must. We put together a training course in anticipation of your arrival. It would be a shame to leave here without seeing you in action. Yes, of course. Well, I mean, if there is time, I would gladly, uh, show you what I know. Here. You see? The situation is well suited to your skills. Have a go! A blade in a crowd is always the simplest. Nothing grandiose, just quick and clean. Show us another technique. Quite ingenious to use bales of hay for cover, don't you think? God, that's the spirit. Secrecy. The advantage of surprise cannot be overstated easily around a blind corner. God blind me, that's a clever trick. Your aerial kills have a poetic beauty, despite their conspicuous quality. Would you show us? Huh? Oh. Magnifique. Is it also possible to deliver a killing blow at high speed? Mon Dieu, such a powerful strike! Will you shut up? Fascinating! The assassins have trained you well, Duncan. You chose a perfect time to leave them behind. At great risk, I imagine. Betraying the assassins is never good for one's health. Well, neither is drinking liquor, but I am drawn to its dangers all the same. And what is your business here, sir? Are you an associate of the governor's, or a pending acquaintance like myself? Guns, blades, cannons, grenados... <laughs> Anything that may kill a man, I am happy to provide. A smuggler of sorts. And how is your wife these days, Captain Rogers? Is she, uh, here? In Havana? I trust she's well, but I wouldn't know. I've been in Madagascar some 14 months hunting pirates. It took some work to dislodge the criminals there, but we managed it. In future, I hope to use these same tactics throughout the West Indies. And how did you deal with that kind? Very simply. Most pirates are as ignorant as apes. I merely offered them a choice. Take a pardon and return to England penniless, but free men. Or be hanged by the neck until dead. Oh. I imagine Nassau would be your next target. Very astute, Duncan, indeed. Best of luck with that. Grandmaster Torres! Mr. Duncan Walpole has arrived. See, si. You were expected one week ago. Apologies, Governor. My ship was set upon by pirates. We were scuttled. I arrived only yesterday. Unfortunate. Forgive my caution, but were you able to salvage from these pirates the items you promised me? Uh, yes, sir. I was. Incredible. The assassins have more resources than I had imagined, but not nearly enough to deter us. 
It is a pleasure to meet you at last, Duncan. You are most welcome. Come, gentlemen. We have much to discuss. <sighs> Convened at last, and in such continental company. England, France, Spain, citizens of sad and corrupted empires. But you are Templars now, the secret and true legislatures of the world. Please, hold out your hands. Mark and remember our purpose. To guide all wayward souls till they've reached a quiet road. To guide all wayward desire till impassioned hearts are cooled. To guide all wayward minds to safe and sober thought. By the Father of Understanding's light, let our work now begin. I'm gonna pick back at them. Decades ago, the Council entrusted me with the task of locating in these West Indies a forgotten place our precursors once called the Observatory. See here. Look up on these images and commit them to memory. They tell a very old and important story. For two decades now, I have endeavored to locate this Observatory. Oh, hello. Place rumored to contain a tool of incredible utility and power. It houses a kind of armillary sphere, if you like. A device that would grant us the power to locate and monitor every man and woman on Earth, whatever their location. Only imagine what it would mean to have such a power. With this device, there would be no secrets among men. No lies, no trickery. Only justice, pure justice. This is the Observatory's promise, and we must take it for our own. Do we know its whereabouts? We will soon. For in our custody is the one man who does. A man named Roberts. Once called a sage. It has been 45 years since anyone has seen a true sage. Can you be sure this one is authentic? We are confident he is. The assassins will come for him. Indeed they will. But... Thanks to Duncan and the information he has delivered, the assassins won't be a problem for much longer. All will be made clear tomorrow, gentlemen, when you meet the sage for yourselves. Until then, let us drink. Hey. Let us find the observatory together. For with his power, kings will fall, clergy will cower. And the hearts and minds of the world will be out. Okay, I'm gonna have to ask you to stop biting me. Rest well, Duncan. Tomorrow the treasure fleet arrives, and with it, your reward. After which we will discuss further schemes. I look forward to it. Excelente. Meet me down at the docks first thing tomorrow morning. No! Stop fighting me! 
Governor Torres requests your presence at the docks near the Castillo. First thing tomorrow morning. So there are quite a few hours. Why? Pirate! Pirate! Run! Leave me alone, Edward! I'm not... Stay out of combat. Oh look, it's a cat. <laughs> Done. May as well do all of the contracts while I'm here. I am anonymous. Bye, pigeon. Ah! 
No se te ha perdido nada. Tengo órdenes. I'll do the rest of the contracts later. Yeah, there's so little ambience. Just over here. Edward! Hello, Edward! I found a man to purchase my remaining sugar! Huh? Quite a coup, I must say! He just called you Edward. Oh, that's the merchant who sailed me here. Out of caution, I gave him a false name. Ah, well done. We'll catch up on it later. Very punctual, Duncan. This way. Here he is. A man both Templars and Assassins have sought for over a decade. I am told your surname is Roberts. Is this so? You recognize this, I think. According to old tales, the blood of a sage is required to enter the observatory. 
We have the key. Now we need only its location. Perhaps Mr. Roberts will be eager to provide it. Transfer him to my residence. Such a fuss over one man. Is the observatory really such a grand prize? See, si, sin duda. The observatory was a tool built by the precursor race. Its worth is without measure. Precursor race? I see. One of your early letters mentioned the desire to kill the Mayan mentor, Atabai. Were you able to carry out this contract before coming here? I... I was not, no. Too many complications along the way. A pity. But the maps you delivered with the blood vial will see that job finished. Aye. That's the idea. I don't like this route, Torres. We're exposed. Something is off. Stay close, Grandmaster. I feel it too. Do not let them get their hands on the stage, at whatever cost. Assassins! Above! They're on the rooftops! Watch the street. They could be anywhere. I don't like that. Not, a, not at all. Oh. Stop it! You're a nimble one, I'll give you that. Back and make this easy on both of us, mate. Nimble one, I'll give you that. Hang back and make this easy on both of us, mate. You. Well done, lapdog. Quiet. We'll see him to the prisons, Grandmaster. Double the watch. Well, I'll be buggered. What an active day we've had, gents. See, we set on our side by our enemies. We must be more cautious. I do wish I could remain to see our drama done, but I must avail myself of these winds and sail for England.
and the means cut and speed unfortunate to you. With luck, I'll return myself a governor. And with my idiot king's blessing, no less. Adios. As for you, Mr. Walpole, I consider this the first payment in a long-term investment. Gracias. Obliged. I would like you to be present for the interrogation tomorrow. Call around noon. Yes, sir. I suppose it's all the time I have for now. <laughs>